Ooh, hair's looking funky. All right. Good morning. It's travel day. We've cleaned up the Airbnb. It's time to go to the airport. got through security security and passport control and they pulled us aside during passport control and we thought it was gonna be a search because I get those a lot I wonder why <laughs> okay anyway it was fast track so we went through super quick Suckers. we got blessed thank you cop and cop found this place, Mango Tree. It looks like they're aware of vegetarian. We managed to get Pad Thai made vegan. Beautiful. Talia, you want chili? Something. All right, how is it? Good, I like it. Cool. Yeah, that's good. Not the best, but it's good. Pad Thai was actually pretty good. It was like, it obviously wasn't the best, but it wasn't the worst one I've had. That was at that thing the other day. Whatever. Got a latte, ice, soy milk, and then also a little mango sticky rice, coconut. Was in the sticky rice, coconut milk for the top. We're about to get on this plane in like 20, 30 minutes. Tuning back in, we just landed. We are somewhere in the Shanghai airport. It is desolate. It's oddly eerie and creepy, would you say? Very. Everything's super fancy, but there's like, like one person for every, it's weird. I don't know how to explain it, but we're looking for food and that's actually kind of challenging, especially with the vegan thing. Let you know how it goes. So I think we ordered a couple dishes. Like a potato dish, a broccoli dish, and a greens dish. Apparently no fish, no anything. We'll see what happens. Okay, we got some broccoli. Looks good. All right, this is looking very tasty. It's like shredded potato, vinegar, soy sauce, spicy peppers. This is where we are. And everybody has been very helpful. Shout out to this guy on the computer. He's been very helpful. And... We have some greens. Things looking good. I think rice is coming. There we go. Bite with the pepper. Tasty. It works. Then we got the broccoli. It just tastes like steamed broccoli with soy sauce. Really tasty. And the greens. It's tasty. A little tough to chew these greens. Tasty though. I'm happy. Try to get rice with this. This is great. Thank you. This little meal we managed to put together. 
Nice. Good looks. Thank you to everybody. Kapun kap. Yo, we just finished our food. It's very tasty. No idea how much it cost. And now I want iced coffee, so that is the mission. Hello. All right, we got ourselves a little Starbucks situation. What you got? Mango passion fruit. Cappuccino. She's really, really digging the camera time. <laughs> Milking it. <laughs> Speaking of milk, I asked for soy milk and Talia brought up a good point. She thinks that people are asking, or people are assuming I'm saying, do you have the brand soya milk? Because there's one out here called soy, yeah, like. So I've just regular cold brew. Still works. But right now we are just waiting to board the flight. Long flight. Alright, that was a crazy flight, but it went pretty smooth. JFK, we here. Are you kidding me? Oh, a warm welcome to the States. It's shaky because I'm shivering. <laughs> We're back in my Prius. We're gonna get some bagels and drive near Cosm because we have to go to Troy in the morning. So we have a hotel there. It's midnight, apparently. Or is it 11? Oh, daylight savings. That shit happened. <laughs> All right, it's like 11. All right, I'll tell you. <laughs> All right, Long Island 24 hour bagel with my baby. And we got bagels and whole wheat everything with some tofu and an almond milk with this iced coffee crumb. This is the best cuisine of Long Island. It's nowhere near as good as all the food we've been eating, but it's pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. Okay, we made it to our hotel in Fishkill, New York, which is right next to Wappinger Falls, which is where Cosm, the Chapel of Sacred Mirrors is, if you know that. We were thinking about stopping there in the morning, but apparently they're closed tomorrow, so it's okay. We'll come another time. Talia has a dentist appointment in Troy, so that's, or Albany, so we're gonna hang out a little bit there and dentist and then to new hampshire and we will officially be back yeah it's a nice hotel it's a nice uh change of pace from airport it was like an hour and a half drive so like and we were in airports and airplanes for like the last 36 hours something like that and then my car and sister's car for another like two hours it's just been a lot and now we have this nice big space. It's actually two queen beds. So yeah, see you in the morning. <music> Reporting live from Fishkill, New York in a hotel. We're gonna go to a local bakery that claims to have vegan options, hopefully coffee also in a Walmart because it is winter now and we have a day to survive so we're gonna get a pair of sweatpants. <laughs> Pouring live from Walmart with my pup, Merka. I got, it. <laughs> this is Walmart fit challenge, you know? I got pants, but I don't have anything to keep me warm. So I got this hoodie. Look at this, generic New York. Pretty flat, I think I could rock it. I know I can't actually. Ty's looking for like a warm shirt and then we are good. I report a lot from the Walmart parking lot. You know what's going on, you see me? Who else is making Walmart look this good? <laughs> Nobody. <laughs> <laughs> We just went to a really dope spot called Ella Bella's, Ella's Bella's, something to that effect. And 
First of all, oat milk latte. Welcome back to oat milk, Tom. What a great feeling. All we were getting was soy milk out there. The little coconut milk, I've told you to, that fresh coconut milk was one of the best shit ever, but oat milk, I missed you. Here we go. Ah, ah. <laughs> then we got vegan brownie, a vegan almond apple upside down cake, and we got some cupcake. We got two cupcakes and I dropped one. But it looks good. I'm very excited to eat this. This is a great fit stop. Shout out to Happy Cow for always giving the hookups. And that was a great atmosphere. Go in there. If you're in, where are we? Fish Cow. But I don't think this town is that. I don't know. Where... Beacon? Beacon. If you're in Beacon, New York, for some strange reason, go in there. They're playing J. Cole at night in the morning. Unedited. There were old white men in there. It was great. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We're going back to the hotel, check out, go up to Troy, you know what it is. I love you. Reporting on the cupcake. That shit was super fire. This is the intact one, but I just hate the slanted one. Super duper fire. This day was quality. <laughs> You got a little Mountain View too. This is actually a fire, fire decision. Very good. We're heading to Albany. About hour 45, I'm gonna get gas. Probably take two hours. Peace. <laughs> okay, what is going on? You're probably wondering, what the? F What's going on? PG-13. You know what I'm saying? PG-11, that's what we're going for. All right, Honest Weight, best place in Albany, period. Honest Weight Food Co-op. Came here for the, the vegan Caesar. One of the best, the one of the best things on earth. What'd you say? Why are you out here cursing on my, my Christian channel? <laughs> Just fucking with y'all. I ain't changing shit. Okay, so I got this. Vegan Caesar, outstanding. Then at the hot bar, they had Thai food because synchronicity, you know what I mean? So Thai, you got the pad Thai. I got some, uh, they labeled it Thai green beans because it was like a peanut sauce. Um, didn't really see that out there. They have morning glory and other things, but I get what they're doing. I see what they're doing. I love it. And I got some, whoa, spicy cabbage, which I'm hype about. And some curried potatoes, which I'm also super hype about. Just know that if you're in this area, Albany, New York, go to Honest Wait. What are you doing? I need the green beans. Spicy cabbage. That shit is out of here. Shit... Some of the best food in the world is that Honest Wait food co-op. I didn't even mention the coffee is phenomenal. I got cold brew the milks they have sitting on the table is organic almond milk and organic coconut milk the sweeteners they have is local maple syrup organic agave like organic cane sugar you gotta love this place so I'm, i made myself a little a little cold brew with organic almond milk and a little local maple syrup because it's freezing outside so i figure a little maple maple is like winter theme my mind goes to winter when i think of maple syrup what about you? No? What what season? She's falling under pressure. <laughs> She's falling under pressure, ladies and gentlemen. Whoa! <laughs> I'm on a new level. You wanna be in this? Oh, that's my pup. I love her more than anything, like, ever. She's the best. Not to, like, compare love, because all love is love. But ours is But, like, come on. This is my pup. I love her so much. <laughs> this potato is rocking. Did you like it? Yeah, it was really good. It was super tasty. Can I get a little more pad thai? Yeah, you can finish it. Oh, yeah. Because I have a cupcake. Whoa. Show the people. <laughs> Looks super bomb. Okay, 
So the first bite of this was a lot better than these last bites. I'm like, it's still really good, but the one we got at the airport was better. Whoa. You can finish this. There's a few noodles. I, th I was. When did this become the cupcake thing? Because this is the second time today. Yeah, right? Have you guys ever seen this? This is the thing now. I just gave myself a uh, pretty two cupcakes today. Well, three. No, they've seen it. It's in the vid. It's how close are they paying attention? <laughs> Before I just end this, let me try to describe to you how good this is. How do you feel about this? Kale Caesar. I think it's one of the best things in Albany. I, I think it was the onions I didn't like, which is weird because I love red onions. They're like slightly pickled. Yeah, they're pickled. I don't like so that. good. I need to learn how to make this. How do you pickle things? You put them in vinegar in a jar. Like how long? A while. What are we talking? Like hours or months? Months. Months? That's crazy. I never knew that. This is so good. Please, we're going to get more food after this, so. I have to gain back all that weight from Thailand that I lost. <laughs> <laughs> it's freezing. So we need to get these bellies. It's bulking season. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hibernation's coming. Nah, but these are great jokes, but stay healthy. There's no need to overeat, but I don't know. We miss Troy, Albany area, so we're getting all of our favorites before we leave. <laughs> all right, love you. These little wings glistening in the sun. <laughs> I cannot believe Bourbon and Wolves is in Troy. Yo. I'm fucking full, but that was one of the most delicious. Wow. How you feel? Very, very full. That was so good. I can't believe Bourbon and Wolves is in Troy. Like, separately. Me and you have both lived within walking distance of this, and then when we lived together, we lived even closer. Insane. I'm wordless, speechless. You're really about a. Look at what she's doing here. I got a three and a half hour drive. She's gonna abandon me for it. She's gonna fall right asleep. Last stop is the grocery store to get the best arrabbiata sauce known to human existence. Well, it's the best one they sell in a jar and it's a dumb deal. It's like 4 dollars it was, hopefully it still is. It's like $4.99 for a 32 ounce jar. Stupid deal. I'm so full, I'm so happy. That was so tasty. Wing Wednesday, I miss you. All right, long drive ahead. Cleaning it up. Sure. <laughs> Peace. Love y'all. <laughs> wow. It's the next morning. We made it home. Passed out the second we got home. I took a shower, passed out. We made it. What a trip. This has been the most incredible experience ever. It's tough to capsulate it with words, but. Wow, I'm so grateful that I've been able to do this with my best friend, <laughs> with my twin flame lover, everything. Incredible. Love you, Talia. This has been an amazing trip. Thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you. Love y'all. It's pretty good energy too. <laughs> and love, positivity, all that good stuff. All right, now I'm leaving.